Alright y'all, what's going on guys, and today we're back with another banger video, and in today's video, as you can tell by the title, I don't know exactly what I titled it, but just know we are here in Flushing, Queens. You wanna show just the scenery real quick? You know, uh, there's barely any buildings here. We're here in Queens today, and we're at Flushing, which is very known for, you know, it's um, Japanese, Asian culture, and there's a lot of different stores that we're gonna be checking out today. We're gonna be going to Anime Castle, this new store called Tesso X, which is made by Tesso Life, as well as the mall. So, you ready, babe? Yeah. Let's go. Alright y'all, so the first stop of today was supposed to be Anime Castle. I've been wanting to go here for a minute, but of course we came too early and it was closed. So we wound up walking back towards where we came and um, basically we found this little like random mall thing. But I don't know, I guess it's because we were out too early. So pretty much everything was mainly closed. Like I found this other anime store and it was closed, even though it said it was supposed to be open on the time like the time said 11 and it was 11 something in the morning but i don't know it's whatever we really came here for tesso x so i'm not gonna complain been wanting to come to tesso x for so long now nah, they got so much stuff in here y'all i'm about to just do some b-roll and some voiceovers because i'm like taken back at the amount of cool stuff that's in here and as you can tell i'm just geeking by this place like i honestly wish i could just spend like a whole day in here like there is so much stuff like i don't know if you guys have even heard about this place or maybe you might have seen it on tiktok or instagram or something but like the pictures and videos just don't do this place justice. There is so many things in here that it's just like, I was so overwhelmed. I was like, oh my God, I don't even know what to like look at. I don't even know what to look for. And keep in mind, I'm just showing you the store side of things. There's a whole claw machine section in the back, with, which we're gonna get to, don't worry, we're gonna get to that. But just overall, just with the figures and stuff and the mysteries and just this thing and like all that, like I was in like heaven. I was like, oh my God, like I really wanted to get this, but it was like 55 bucks and I was like, damn i don't know if i could drop 55 on that right now like i don't know i want all three of them so it's like i if i buy one i know i'm gonna have to buy them all so i just held off on that and honestly like all these different mystery things that i've never even seen before i was just like bro like i don't even know what to do they had some really cool like legos though like not like real lego like brand lego but like really cool just like you know building block sets i guess you could call them and then they had these shug art figures i don't know how to say the actual brand name i know they're called like sf fig arts something like that i just just ignore me but um yeah they had some really cool statues as well i pretty much had everything in here that like i really wanted though so like there wasn't really any figures that i wanted to buy at the moment but it's still a place i'm definitely going to go back to but yeah like literally like, look at this whole wall just look at it but let's try out the claw machines now because that is what i'm really really excited for so guys this is really why me and amanda came here today is because you're doing 15 bucks oh my god because of the new claw machine section in here that's really like obviously all the anime figures is fire you guys just saw it. but like amanda really wanted to come for the claw machines and honestly me too yeah they got like cool stuff in the claw machine so amanda wanted up putting 15 dollars into the claw machine um just to get some tokens because it does go by tokens like good thing it goes by tokens because if it was just like you know like i could just like tap my card i would have been going all day long like i would have been going all day long but she put 15 in which is basically 15 tokens and each machine takes about two to three tokens depending on it so you could do the math it's really like you know like three to four five tries depending on what machines you use and stuff but like this is what i'm talking about like the machines themselves it's not just like stuffed animal stuff like you have literal bare bricks in these machines and i'm like yo like you're gonna see I'm, I'm gonna go for some stuff i'm gonna go for some stuff but like these machines right here was really what was catching my eye like i said like i really just want to put like 50 dollars in a machine one day and just go crazy on it and see what we could do so might have to do that for another youtube video or at least like a tiktok and then this is amanda putting some more money into the coins because like i said it's addicting um but then they had a sony angel one which in case you guys don't know amanda's really into sony angels right now so she was attempting to go for some sony angels and you're gonna see by the claw it's it's kind of hard to grab anything so yeah but we did figure it out eventually we kept going for the sony angels i think we did three times total if i'm not mistaken and on the third try she was able to get it this was with her last two coins so she did get one she did get one so that was really cool and then this was me trying it out on the actual like bare brick machines and like those type of ones and i really thought i was gonna get it on this like i don't know it was really convincing i grabbed this random thing that wasn't even what i was going for but it just picked it up underneath the bare brick so this is amanda trying for it yeah she didn't she didn't get she didn't get it at all but i was determined i was really determined to get this bare brick like i really wanted this it wasn't even like a bare brick it was like 
is it called like a Kubrick or something like that i forgot the actual name of it but it's like a star wars collab thing and i've never seen those ones before so i really wanted them and like the, this machine was actually really good like it actually picked it up it's just when it hits the thing and it does the little shake thing that it drops them so like like i said i feel like if i you know spent a decent amount of money i would actually be able to like get something but like i said once it goes up it just kind of kind of just shakes it off so i think this is my last try right here and i was really determined to get it and then it just like yeah i'm not even gonna just just watch to see what happens right now yep you thought you thought you had it and then it, it flipped it up though and then the dude said that we had one more try left which i don't know how we had one more try left but he called me back over he was like yo there's one more so i don't know if he low-key finessed it but i thought i had it with that one and it was just like damn it shook it out and then i found these naruto bear brick head think bear bricks what am i talking about naruto like brick head things if you know what i'm talking about like the lego brick heads so might want to pick these up one day i don't know two hours later all right guys i don't know if you remember but we came here a minute ago and we came to chuck e cheese because she made us go in uh but we're not doing that today not today sorry keep walking no chuck e cheese but we are currently in the mall right now um we're gonna, we need food we're hungry uh, we could have got some, you know, nice food at some restaurant outside, but we wanted Chick-fil-A and apparently there's no Chick-fil-A in here anymore, so I don't know. Okay, so I wound up running into Uniglo real quick while Amanda went into Marshall's because I did need to get a dress shirt for a wedding I have. Um, but I was like, you know, I gotta look at the, I gotta look at the t-shirts real quick. So I actually wanted to find some pretty good tees. I'm still trying to find that one Aaron Yeager tee, the one with like the, you know, the spine on the back, the Titan form, whatever it is. Like, I don't know what they're calling that one. But then I saw the Bleach collection and I was like, you know what? I've been watching Bleach recently. I'm in a Bleach mood. I like this t-shirt. This red is cool. I've never seen like a red tee like this. The print looks tough. So I'm gonna pick it up. So I wanted to get in that in my dress shirt. So it came out like- All right, I'm pulling up on Amanda right now. She don't see me. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> okay, next stop was the Adidas outlet, which was in the mall as well. These were actually pretty cool, but like, you know, nothing too crazy. Caught my eye. I really was looking for some Sambas. Now, I know that sounds very generic, but I really want to get a white pair of Sambas and dye them. And I feel like the best place to find that would be at the outlet. Um, I know Sambas are really hype right now, so it's kind of like hard to do that. But they did have this black pair and I was really tempted to cop it, but they were at the outlet for a reason. Like they just fit weird. Like it wasn't like the regular Samba fit. And like they just, there was some problems like scuffs and just like discoloration on the shoes. So you could tell why they was like that. But yeah, they also had this claw machine, vending machine thing. All right, y'all, we are now in Target. This is the last stop in the mall that we're gonna go to. And then we're gonna go get Chipotle because we're hungry. And then I don't know what we're gonna do after that. All right, y'all, we made it to, you know, the Target toy section always gotta look in the toy section clearance section i haven't seen one of these in a minute because every target that we go to don't even got enough Lightning stock McQueen. to have clearance <laughs> what no, is it lightning mcqueen oh uh -huh. yeah i've been looking for the spider-man like figures that have came out but i've never really been able to find them i've seen like a few of them which one that one that's like the big ones though I don't want the bit. Also on TikTok right now, I don't know if y'all saw, but everybody's ripping the heads off of these yes. and leaving it. I don't yes. know why. They gotta stop. Oh, we found our first cop of the day. We found our first cop of the day. I can't grab my hands. Oh, through. I got it. I got it. I got it. Yo, look, the new Spider Gwen cover. We have one. all of them besides the Black Spider Man one yeah. that came out because we missed that one. But this is the new one that just came out. Damn. Gotta get it. Gotta get it. Wait, you get in it or I'm getting it? I mean, you get it because it fits your room. I mean, maybe if I wanted. Oh. Amanda found what she wants. Dorables. She found squishy dorables as well. Whatever that means. Apparently, there's squishy ones now. squish -a lots That's what it's called. <laughs> but this is what she really wants. Series 9. Now, we're coming to the back section Can't of Target. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, my God. There's a lot. Let me look. This is probably the best section I've seen in a minute, though. I'm not going to lie. Mm -hmm. Look, they got, like, Naruto stuff. They got Dragon Ball. They got... One Piece, Demon Slayer, the, all these mysteries, which is low-key crazy. They never have this many mysteries at once. And they have another little section, <laughs> which is kind of cool. Little random Funko Pops and stuff. This is what their manga section is looking like. Loki got a lot. They got box sets too, which is kind of crazy. Where? The Attack on Titan one, like the oh, little wow. box set. <laughs> Interesting. All right, y'all, we're at Brian Park right now. We just took some photos for Amanda and, uh, yeah. Can I do it by the water fountain? You want to do some by the water fountain? I could try it. Push the kid, push yeah, the push kid. the kid. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> I'll push you in. All right, y'all. We just ordered a little fruit cup from the little fruit station. So hopefully it's good. Hopefully it's cold. I got it. All right, y'all. You already know. 
Kino time. All right, y'all, we upstairs right now, so about to look around and see what they got real quick. They haven't had nothing new in a minute. Like in a while. Again, I haven't watched Trigun, so none of these new Trigun pops interest me. I should have bought Chainsaw Man last time I was here. Because now they don't have it at all. He's literally nowhere, so it's big rip for Chainsaw Man. Damn. I forgot these stairs be a workout. Oh my god. You forgot how to what? Oh no. Nah. Okay, you pick two from the Doctor Stone? Alright, if we get dupes, it's your fault. Because you picked the two. Those are the two that you're picking? Trust? Yeah. Trust? Okay. Okay, time to make our way upstairs. What happened? Yes. You just stepped on your skirt? Oh my god, baby. You could have fell down the stairs and died. Oh, I pulled it out a little bit because I saw my underwear. <gasps> they still don't got Jockin. They only got Rin, Kikio, but no Jockin. Uh, look at this big three pack they got of the Rancor with Luke. That's tough. It's 40 bucks. It's not too bad. For that big ass rancor. They got this huge Tanjiro. Like he's actually like one of the biggest things I've seen. Like one of the biggest like statues like this that I've seen. It's not bad. 53 though. Eh. Look at the, the amazing Spider-Man. Amazing fantasy Spider-Man. Because he's got the web wings. Wait what? Yeah the Sandy figure is really fire. We got Sandy. We got Simpsons ones. We got Anim... Anim... How do you say that? Animaniacs. I can never say that. Animaniacs. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You can't pronounce nothing. Wait. Guys, guys, guys. That's tough. That's tough. Oh my god. This didn't come out yet. I had this on box lunch. <laughs> That's the new stuff. Oh, they got the one from Kirkros. They got Kirkro. That's tough. It's cool. And it's okay if you don't. That's I'm more interested in Look, you know, all the princesses too. Eddie Yeager. Who's that? They got Bleach. Oh, new Bleach figures too. Oh, the new Naruto one with him doing the Rasengan, and then it's supposed to connect to Sasuke doing the Shidori. Oh, wow. <laughs> Damn, they're charging 32 here. You got the girl from 86. That's the one you're looking for, no? Yeah. I said I was gonna find. I said it earlier today. I said I was gonna find it. Oh, Sailor Moon cats. It's pretty cool. I love all these statues, but like, three hundred dollars is crazy. Yeah, you're not wrong, buddy. Oh my God. Oh, Mr. Taji with his big ears. Oh, I'm gonna go home and kiss my dog. What the? What's that? You tell me what that is. Oh, hell no. <laughs> cashed out? Cashed out. Cashed out. Cashed in, cashed out. I didn't buy anything at Tesla, so. So, you <laughs> spent the same here. <laughs> I spent the same here. Sound card? That's cool. I don't think I bought, well, no, I bought something from here. Yeah? I don't know what, but. Alright, y'all. We're back at the crib. And as you saw from our day out, it might not seem that long, but we've been out since like 11 o'clock this morning, earlier. 10. 10 o'clock this morning. It's currently like five o'clock. So we do got a good little haul of stuff. I'm not gonna lie. I got a bunch of different things from like different, uh, what would you call it? Dude, I got a bleach t-shirt. We got 86, Attack on Titan, Spider-Man, Dr. Stone, Dorables, Sony Angels. So we got a lot of stuff to go through. So I guess let's just start off with mysteries. Okay, cool. So let's start off with mysteries. Um, first thing that we did get was the Sony Angels. Uh, if you guys saw, Amanda sent me sent me the clip, hopefully, of her winning the Sony Angel from the Amanda claw machine. machine. So that was cool. And then she bought two as well. So yes. Ready to open them? I'm not gonna look at them. What is it? Aww, little bunny. Makes it white. Isn't this it? is what she got. Those ones I'm so excited. We should have just bought them all. Aww. Ice cream. <laughs> Look, That's cute. <laughs> the, the ice cream. It's like an ice cream with waffle cone. Yeah, right? I think we have this already. I don't think so. I think we do. You think we have that? One, two, three. Eeyore. Who? Oh. Many. This dude again. Oh my god, Karen. Getting bugs. Yo, we literally got. Nah. Yeah, I'm good, gang. 
Screw adorables. All right. Subs. I've been wanting to get Dr. Stone bag clips for a minute because I've seen them for a while, but I feel like every time I saw them, they were always like eight, nine dollars because like some companies and like places be marking them up, like especially Hot Topic and Box Lunch. So I feel like they never are $5.99. So these ones were $5.99 and I saw them at Midtown Comics and I was like, you know what? I've been seeing them for a while. I want to get them. I like pretty much all the characters on Dr. Stone. Um, I, would I said prefer... I wanted him to get the girl with she the bow tie. <laughs> I picked them out and yeah. I felt them out and I felt different. She so wants Kohaku. They're she wants Kohaku. Me personally, I don't want. I want uh, Senku. Obviously, like he's the goat. Um, probably Gen. Um, maybe Sukiya. So yeah. They were different though. You ready? Because I felt them oh. Wait. I saw it. I saw it though. One, two, three. You said you grabbed two different ones. You said you grabbed two different ones! Of course, the one person I didn't want. They both felt different. Really? Because they're exactly the same. No way. I'm tight. I'm tight. Now I gotta buy more when I see them because I'm not going out like this with Dr. Stone. Literally, I would have preferred anybody else but him. Because he's so basic, like, there's nothing cool about him. You know, I'm not stopping until I get Senku or Suhia or Chrome or again. <sighs> and I went into um, Uniqlo. Uniqlo and I needed to get a shirt for a wedding that I have. So I had to get a dress shirt. And then I saw this bleach tee and I don't have any red t-shirts, but this looks pretty cool. So I like the way that the graphic looked on it and the red isn't like a bright red either. So I thought it was a nice little t-shirt to get because I don't have anything from the bleach collection. I try to get like one thing from like each Uniqlo collection that comes out. But I haven't watched Bleach yet until recently, so now I actually felt, you know, knowledgeable enough to buy a Bleach item. So, you boy to get Bleach. And found this at Target. Very excited about this, because in case you don't know, I have a whole wall right here with Venom, Spider-Man, and Miles Morales. So this one will go right above Miles Morales. And yeah, probably gonna hang it up once this video is done. And then I wound up getting two figures, as you guys just saw. This was like a last minute thing. Like we weren't even gonna go to Midtown Comics, okay. but. And these things, I don't know if you guys saw it in the video. Amanda was recording, right? You were recording it. But this was just like, these weren't out yet. So there was, there was just, just a, a stockpile. There was a whole stockpile. Like the guy must have just got a shipment in because he was saying something to his coworker. And there was like a whole shipment of these in, right? But they were out of the box. Obviously, it was just them all stacked up. And I see Aaron. I literally grab him on top of the box. I was like, yep, I'm going to grab him right away. And then we go around the corner and we see on the other side of the big pile. And we see the 86 figure that I've been saying I've been wanting to get since I saw it at Kino that one time. And I and it was gone right after that so yeah got two figures that aren't naruto figures so that's pretty much it for today hope you guys did enjoy and uh catch you guys in the next one we out i'm on a road i can't get caught i'm a been different stage my mama blowing on my phone seeing if i'm okay i had to get up out the hood finding